Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of TTI. Today, we will explore all about howitzer, the artillery many like to see but many fear. When the military needs propellant charges thrown over long distances with a vertical descent, a howitzer is what they would use. The barrels of the howitzer are short and stand somewhere between a cannon and a mortar. In some other countries, howitzers are classified as guns with the barrel's length 15 to 25 times the size of their caliber or any weapon with longer barrels. Join me as we explore seven of the fastest howitzers in the world. M109A7 Paladin This beauty is the M109A7 Paladin, an upgraded version of the ubiquitous M109, another howitzer that self-propels. The M109A7 was allowed into production in 2013 and the first artillery system that was introduced into the United States in 2015. This new model came with unique specifications. Its range of fire is up to 24 kilometers, with a regular projectile and 30 kilometers when aided by a rocket. The rate of fire of the M109A7 Paladin is four rounds in a minute. Paladin is credited for its quick reaction time. Paladin carries spare ammunition under its armor and travels with an ammunition supply vehicle. These added vehicles also have the same chassis number as the Paladin does. FH-77BW L-52 Archer Our next howitzer was created in Karlskrona, Sweden by BAE Systems. This FH-77BW L-52 Archer is self-propelled and one of the fastest in the world. This howitzer is 155mm carried on a 6x6 chassis. The range of the howitzer is 40 kilometers, and this is with standard ammunition. Add the M9A2 Excalibur round and the range changes to 60 kilometers. You can find this howitzer in international peacemaking and enforcement missions, fire support in military warfare, and many other areas where this caliber's machinery is required. In 2005 and 2006, the prototype of this model entered firing trials in Sweden. The average speed you can get from this model is 70 kilometers in an hour with a range of 1,000 kilometers per day. Interestingly, this particular system is supported by an ammunition resupply vehicle, also referred to as an ARV. These ARV accommodates the reload of the howitzer in minutes. The FH-77 can fire a wide range of shells including explosives, eyes, Excalibur, and a bonus. It has a very long reach and high fire rate, and the ability to integrate with the Volvo A30E dumper. PLZ-05 Our next howitzer is the PLZ-05, popularly known as the Type 05. This newly developed Chinese craft also self-propels and is 150 mm long. Type 05 is equipped with an automatic loading system for its ammunition similar to that of the Russian 2S19 MSTAS. The firing range on this baby is over 40 km when the projectile is aided by a rocket. Like the Russian Krasnopol technology, this howitzer can also fire laser-guided missiles. Although this has not been confirmed, it is suspected that projectiles guided by GPS can attain a maximum range of 100 kilometers. The fire rate is 10 rounds in a minute, and like many, however, it is accompanied by an ARV. These ammunition resupply vehicles can hold up to 90 rounds of ammo and can even automatically deliver these ammunitions as necessary. Type 99 Of course, the Japanese too created a self-propelled howitzer and named it the Type 99. Both the Japan Steelworks and the Mitsubishi Heavy Industries came together to produce this beauty. Currently, under the order of the Japanese Ground Self-Defense has many of these howitzers in service. None of them, however, has ever been exported. With a standard HeFrag projectile, the maximum range of fire is 30 kilometers, and it goes up to 38 kilometers with a rocket-assisted shot. 
The fire rate is also awe-inspiring, with up to six rounds being fired in a single minute. The Type 99 self-propelled howitzer resupplies from the Type 99 ARV. The howitzer's battery also includes a mobile command post and a radar for fire control. The K-9 Thunder The K-9 Thunder is the name of the South Korean self-propelled howitzer. To meet the requirements for a 21st century howitzer, the Republic of Korea Army created designs for a new 155mm tracked howitzer. They ensured it include a higher fire rate, a more extended range, it is more accurate and has a faster reaction time. The K-9 Thunder was officially developed in 1989 and went into active service in 1999. They also ensured the K-9 had an automatic ramming and shell handling system in place, along with all those new and improved features. It works great with the NATO 155mm ammunition. With the standard HEFRAG, the maximum fire range is 30 km and can go up to 40 km when using rocket-assisted projectiles. Like the Type 99, the K-9 Thunder has a firing rate of 6 rounds per minute, and unlike the Type 99, can do a multiple round simultaneous impact fire. There is an automatic fire control system with internal navigation and an automated gun laying system. Both firing and placement and movement can be done in under 90 seconds. The K-9 Thunder has its ammunition resupply vehicle with the same chassis. Reloading the howitzer can be done 100% automatically without exposing the crew to danger or open fire. Two S35 Kolitsia SV. The latest collection in the Russian artillery is the Two S35 Kolitsia SV, being the successor of the Two S19 MSTAS. This Russian beauty had big shoes to fill. Now, let us look at its timeline. The first demonstration of this self-propelled howitzer was in 2006. By 2013, the prototype was in full force and included only single-gun howitzers. <music> 2015 was the year when the Russian army received the first dozen artillery systems. Today, these howitzers are still among the best in the world. The handling and ammunition loading is fully automatic on this system and uses a modular charge. Various ammunition types such as the cluster, standard projectiles, the HEFRAG rocket assist, and jammer carrying missiles can work with this model. With a classic shot, the range of fire is 30 km, and when a rocket assist is added, it is up to 40 km. This howitzer can fire at a rate of 8 rounds in a minute, and it is also capable of simultaneous impact fire from multiple rounds. Panzerhaubitze PZH-2000 Last on the list is the Panzerhaubitze 2000, also known as the PZH-2000. This German self-propelled howitzer is one of the most advanced on this list. Originally, the German army wanted 1,254 self-propelled howitzers in this model. However, when the contract was ready, only 185 artillery systems were approved. This system is competent. Like many others on this list, they are automatically loaded and equipped with a management system for ammunition. The max range of fire is 30 km with a standard HEFRAG projectile and 40 km when a rocket assist missile is added. The rate of fire is an impressive 9 rounds in a minute. It too can fire as a multiple round simultaneous impact fire. Even if the trajectories are different, this machine can launch several shells in different directions all at once. Thanks for watching. You made it to the end of another awesome video. Which of these machines did you find the most impressive? Let me know in the comments section below. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe for more excellent content. See you in the next video.